So, uh, yeah, Dan, Dan and I, Dan and I have uh, been best friends since high school. And, uh... Yeah, let me tell you all how that evolved, actually, because Wayne's not going to tell the story, right? So this is what really happened. Okay. So I meet Wayne in high school, and we find out that we're both magicians. And like, oh, well, let's go be David Blaine on the street and film stuff. So I'm like, all right. <laughs> it wasn't quite yeah, that. Well, whatever, we did that. <laughs> so, you know, we'd go down. Chico has a couple, like, farmer's market type things. So we'd go down and film. We'd just trade off. You know, Wayne would film me doing some stuff, and... I filmed him, and then we started looking at the footage and realizing that Wayne was a lot better at it than I was. <laughs> <laughs> so I kind of shifted into the other role eventually. Yeah. Uh -huh. Thank you. So I was doing a lot of like uh, theater shows and, and working at uh, working for some mm -hmm. corporate uh, stuff, and, and also doing magic in a bar. And a few, what was it like four years ago when we started actually doing the videos for the website? Yeah, I think About so. Four or five years ago. It was. Uh, it yeah. seems like it went by so quick. Well, we started filming just videos for my website. This is back when nobody had any idea that I was doing magic in the magic community. Um, well, I was just doing everything myself in, in Chico and performing and making a living doing it. And then Chris Angel called and we got involved with him. And then that led into Stigmata from Illusionist. Basically, Jonathan Bain, who we're now working with, uh, contacted us. And, said he wanted to, to do a video with us, and uh, he was very persistent because I turned him down for like four months. <laughs> <laughs> and finally told him the only way I'd do a video through Illusionist is if Dan and I produced it, because they wanted to produce it. And so we produced Stigmata. That was our first, like, the first time we actually produced a like, full DVD, because up to that point, Dan and I were just doing like, you know, five minute video clips that we put on my website. Excuse me. See how it turned red because you were squeezing? Seven. Was it seven? Yes. But basically, I had made it, I, I was successful as a performer, not within the magic community. Nobody knew who I was except Manichek. Right. But I was doing my own shows, creating my own material, and making money performing. And then kind of without really looking for it, I kind of fell into being known in the magic community, while at the same time I was really starting to get heavy into video production, and that has kind of led me to where I am today. So. You guys are awesome. Yeah, thank you. Thanks for taking it to the next level. Well, Very thank you. Cool. Thank you. Absolutely.